Welcome, friends, to a change of pace. The holiday spirit we've decided to embrace and bring all you lucky lads at home the best Christmas story from here to Rome. Twas the night before Christmas, you all know the tale. Not a creature was stirring, not even a whale. Our story takes place in the home of Santa, in the faraway, mystic land of Atlanta. Here Santa lives with a small group of elves, who do most of the Christmas work themselves. Underpaid and locked underground, the elves were questioning why they stick around. 189 an hour for this job. But who's gonna hire pointy-eared slobs? But this isn't a story about the elves, no. It's about monsters trudging through the snow. All of a sudden, there was a knock upon Santa's door, which caused Santa to panic like never before. Who is outside my door on this cold winter day? If you're from the IRS, I'm innocent! Go away! But when Santa opened the door, to his surprise, it was not the IRS standing before his eyes. Instead, there was a hipster standing there engrossed, carrying a piece of avocado toast. This filled Santa with a feeling of dread, fearing, more than anything, that piece of bread. Elves, come quickly, bring me my shotgun! The hipster apocalypse has just begun! Santa pointed the gun and began to yell, Get out of my home or go straight to hell! But the hipster simply smiled and walked inside, and offered some toast to the elves, and they replied, Ooh, free food, yay! We can't afford proper food with our pay! Both elves took a bite into the bread, and felt something in their bodies start to spread. Oh god, I feel like a ghost! Would you like some avocado toast? Santa tried to save himself, pointing the gun at the elf, but he knew his time was short, and he would get no more support. Back! Back, you foul beast! But alas, soon, poor Santa would feast. <laughs> and that's our story for the night. I hope it was truly a delight. Our world really is becoming a mess, but Christmas is a time to forget all your stress. So sit back and enjoy your Christmas roast. Maybe even have some avocado toast. But most importantly, enjoy your holidays, everyone. After all, the apocalypse has only just begun. That's fine, we can cut it before that. We yeah. can cut it after I do that. We'll not reach Have the credits and then play the rest. <laughs> yeah, yeah, cut it, play blue, just chuck. <laughs> Alright, I need to have paper down. Great what? behind the scenes content. Great what? behind the scenes content. Thanks, shut up, turn off the phone. Who's the if you dead? So, Kesha, we want to know why. We want to know your opinion on not getting paid. <laughs> What's your opinion on not getting paid for this film? Legally, I cannot give you my opinion. Do you think TD Bank should sponsor this? Legally, I cannot give you my opinion. <laughs> Screw you. Hey. Find the scene. Um, hey. Behind the scenes. Behind the scenes. No, because this is the test that he's had in his mouth. So. The school stick! The school friends! Why did I get it? So, how do you like the toast? I haven't eaten that tree. No, that's alright. You're watching on an you know, I'm behind the scenes. That's illegal. Behind the scenes, behind the scenes. We're all fully dressed. We're putting on shirts. Alright, what are you guys doing? <laughs> okay, get up, we're filming. No, we're done. That's our story for the night. I hope it was truly a delight. Our world really is becoming a mess, but Christmas time is a time to forget all your stress. So, sit back and enjoy your Christmas roast. Maybe even have some avocado toast. Doing an a fan interview with the lead actor of Kiwi Studios. Any fan questions? <laughs> nope, you don't have any fans. <laughs>